Wow. Wow. In my lungs, yeah, go on my wrist, go, go on my wrist, bro, go, yeah. Boom, in my lungs, yeah, go on my wrist, whoa, go on my wrist, whoa, go, yeah. Today's video, I'm a bit confusion because, well, actually, no, I'm not. I know what's going on. Um, as you can see by the title, my roommate left. Yes, I have a shirt on. I just don't have anything over it yet because I'm not going nowhere just yet. But that's not the point of this video. The point of the video is my roommate left. And it was because of a reason. It was like, I was just basically telling her what was on my mind. I did not want to let certain stuff slide because for a long time I've like held my tongue about certain stuff she did and I'm <laughs> she didn't really take it the way I like didn't think it was a big deal because um all right I'm gonna just tell y'all what's up like uh my roommate like she's sweet like we had our like great time together while she was here but like if you tell her something she'll get like real closed in and she gets sensitive and all that extra stuff but she always texts me like to let me know when she get when i get back to the dorm right and her boyfriend lives here too so he's downstairs so sometimes he like comes up here and mind you i'm never in my dorm like i'm always with my friends or something and if you hear the door um like keep making noise the window actually i'm about to close the window okay um her boyfriend lives downstairs so like sometimes she's down there or sometimes he come up here and i'm never in my dorm so like i don't really be caring so um but like our agreement to each other was to let each other know when we had company so that way um, like if we needed to change or take a shower that you know they had to do so you know um it was like stuff like that that we agreed on to do so sometimes she will fail to do that sometimes I'll fail to do that but then we will like you know tell each other like hey I thought we were you know but um when I'm gone she usually texts me like hey he's coming over and I'll sometimes I wouldn't respond because I'm bad at texting or sometimes like I'll just be like okay um but she would also text me like hey can you let me know when you're coming back and if you get a text like that that's gonna like make you think like okay they might be having sex or they I don't know that's the only that's the only um thing that was on my mind because why else would she ask me to let me know to let her know um, when I'm coming back like if I should just come back whenever I please so you know um so it was one night uh, she had text me that and like I I was so tired of just not responding and just saying okay I wanted to let her know how I felt right but I didn't I didn't like tell her in a mean way i told her in the nicest way possible but she took it as being disrespectful and all i told her was okay but if he's going to be over and y'all are going to you know do the little nasty can you just please open the window because one our room is already stuffy and hot and a mixture of the smell of sex also makes the room smell even worse so um i mean sometimes it's not even a sex sometimes it's like something like in our refrigerator that we might have left um in there too long but you know like the difference between it so um i just told her like if y'all gonna like you know start having sex just open the window just crack the window open to let it air out 
And she took it as me saying that I'm telling her what to do with her body, basically. And nowhere in that text message did I say that. Um, I, when I when she said that, I responded back, but I wasn't, like, snapping on her. I was kind of like, I don't know. But you can't really, like, tell their tone of voice during like through text, but, like, you could see in the text that I wasn't, like, mad or anything. I was just telling her to just open the windows. She didn't text back, and then afterwards, she hasn't talked to me since. I um, asked her a question. She acted like she didn't want to respond. So I was just like, okay, like I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stress over the fact that you want to walk around being mad and not being a grown woman about it, and just saying like, hey, I didn't like what you said, and maybe we could have talked it out. But my thing is, she just really just ignored me the whole thing, and like now. I don't know where she is. It's a possibility that she's downstairs, moved in with her boyfriend, what I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to do. Um, because they we do have inspections, and they're going to look over to the side of the room and ask me where she at, and I'm going to be like, I don't know. She decided to move out because, you know, she got mad at me, and we never talked, to, talked it out. So, And one thing I've learned, to bring your own stuff, because... Um, at the beginning of the year, we agreed to share the microwave. It's gone. <laughs> but luckily, I don't have, I don't really have anything to, um, heat up. So, I'm straight. Like, I got, I'm, I'm cool, actually. Like, being alone, sometimes it's good, but sometimes you just want that company. But, like, I have friends, so, like, I invite them over. But, yeah, that's that one lesson I got to keep in mind to bring my own microwave, refrigerator. I got my own refrigerator. But, like, everything else, I'm going to just, you know what, like, just take with me just in case I have an altercation with another roommate next year or something. So, uh, yeah, my roommate just decided to, you know, dip. Um, she took all her stuff. Uh, yeah, it's pretty empty in here besides my side of the room. Um, yeah, that is the end of this video. I just wanted to share this with y'all because I didn't want y'all to like, in my next videos, I didn't want y'all to like question like, why is it so empty on this side of the room? Even though I had a camera like right here, I could have it like somewhere else. Um, but yeah, this is why she moved out. But I don't think she's gonna be down there long because she's not supposed to be with, um, you're not supposed to live with a guy here unless you like pay my I don't know her whole detail but yeah it's a possibility she's down there or she might be in another room but I'll find out it I don't know but yeah this is the end of this video I hope you like this uh give this video a thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe to this channel and comment what you want to see next and I will do an update on my hair growth. As y'all can see that it did grow. This is a, uh, dang, this twist out, this twist out is like four days old, I want to say. And like, I just, I tried to refresh it. Um, I might deep condition it later on tonight. But yeah, y'all see the growth. But I'll get that. I'll do that in another video. But, um, thank you guys for watching, and again, this is Special K, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!